Hi guys, so I'm going to be uploading and scheduling some videos and then I'm gonna, um, yeah, that's what I'm gonna be doing. Also, I just called the gym lad to ask him if he was okay and to see where he was because he's supposed to be popping by the Dollar Tree to buy another box for me, like a wooden craft box, to add to a, oh, wow, maybe I should have gone myself, to add to a centerpiece that I made for the table. I'm gonna pop a picture here so you guys can see. To add to the centerpiece that I made for the table, because I wanna make it like a little bit higher. I never thought of that when I was at the Dollar Tree, which is why I didn't do it then, but I'm trying to see. Now I'm trying to see if I can get him to buy like two different, um, two of the boxes. I'm gonna just text him and see when he gets to the Dollar Tree, buy two of the boxes instead of one. The box looks like little crates, two cutouts at the side. So, my creative juices are flowing, as you guys can obviously see, because I, ah, oh, let me just tell you, I'm literally so excited about the um, centerpiece that I made for my table, because I've been scouring the internet to find one that is a little bit cheaper than $80, because I feel like it is seasonal, and I don't like spending too much money on seasonal items, because you only use it for a period, and then you put it up, you put it in storage, some of the leaves might fall off, you get the general idea, so, Seasonal things like that, I don't like paying too much money for. And today was inside of the Dollar Tree. I wasn't even there for myself. So proud of me. And I got so inspired. And I seen the piece that I got so inspired. And honestly, I can sit here and say that I was judged OD when I started picking up the pieces. The man was like, um, what is going on? What are all these things? And I feel so good to know that I created something so beautiful that is going to make me so happy every time I look at my table. So we're in business. So I'm making this small one and then I think tomorrow I'm gonna pop by the Dollar Tree So I maybe get some flowers to put in this small one. This is gonna be like a vase, you know? Maybe tomorrow too I could um, buy another one to put on top of this so it's not so short, but this doesn't actually need to be like long or anything because it's gonna go right in the living room here. So if it's small, it's okay. All right guys, so I went to the Dollar Tree and I just came back. I'm trying to see, because I bought a few things. I'm gonna insert a clip here of things that I got and show you guys. So I think this is the arrangement that I'm gonna work with. I can't remember what I have or like how it looks or whatever. And then I got the foam, some bows to wrap onto the tree. Let me flip it over. And then the box, this other box to like put the foam inside of. I don't know. I just need to come out of here. I ended up finding some stick glue for my glue gun, which I'm so excited about because I did buy some last night, but they're too flat so they can't hold in there. And my glue gun is small. I'm trying to see if I want to make this like a bigger, a bigger thing or if I want it to be small. So I think I'm going to do it with just one to begin with. And then if I want it to be taller, then I'll do that. Or I'm going to save this to make another one that's more like pretty much every season, you know? And buy some eucalyptus leaves on, on Amazon. Now, I bought these to put on the Christmas tree. So we're going to put those on there any minute now. And then um, 
I'm gonna just start breaking these apart and like putting them in here. All while I'm texting my daughter and my friend, Carl's. Thank you. 